up everybody? So our workout for Thursday, all right? It starts off, we have three sets of this kind of quality ish piece right here. Uh, it's gonna be a lot to do with overhead and core stability. We have 150 foot Philly carry, all right? So what that is, is a kettlebell in the front rack and a dumbbell overhead, all right, at the same time. So you'll go 150 feet, all right? Then you'll switch, kettlebell on the other side, dumbbell on the other side, switch, go to that 150 on there. And then we'll go into six and six Philly lunge. Yep, it's just like that carry. So we're gonna have one dumbbell overhead, one kettlebell in the front rack. We're gonna do six lunge steps alternating. So the other side, six lunge steps alternating. All right, and then 30 seconds, top ring support with a halt with a tuck. All right, so we're gonna be at the top of the rings. Ideally, the eye of the armpit, elbow pit, will be forward. All right, uh, we want that external rotation right there, so we're strong on top of the rings and we're gonna be tucked up. All right, knees as high as we can get them. All right, if we go to neutral, that's not quite as good as those uh, forward. If we start internally rotating, we're gonna definitely go to some matadors to try to hold that top support. All right, and then five strict toe to bar to finish up. All right, so scaling for this would be just like knees as high as we can get them, feet as high as we can get them, but keep it strict, keep a nice smooth rhythm where we're not swinging back and forth. We're going right into uh, this piece right here. We're going to have 50 sit-ups, 50 hand, strict handstand push-ups, 40 sit-ups, 12 strict handstand push-ups, 30, 9, 20, 6, 10, 3. All right, so we got descending reps. Sit-ups, just keep those arms long and try to keep them moving and breathe there. Strict handstand push-ups, kipping will not be a scaling option. So if these numbers are too voluminous, we're going to move to like pike on the box. If that happens to be too easy and you're somewhere between pike on the box and uh, handstand push-ups on the wall, we can even make that a deficit pike on the box. That way it make it a little bit harder, but we will not be tipping today for this second portion. Come out, enjoy this workout. 